Welcome back to Weg's Garage. Remember a couple weeks ago when I said that it was our last chance to drive the car before winter? Eh, might have miscalculated. Yeah, it's really nice outside. So today on the program, we're gonna try to answer a question that's been asked by literally fives of people on our 1964 Triumph TR4, and that is, is our overheating issue actually caused by a leaking head gasket? Stay tuned. was telling you on our overheating issue that the possibility exists about exhaust gases getting into the coolant. Well, a buddy of mine told me about block tester, which is a good way to tell if um, any exhaust gases are getting into your coolant. Block tester is nothing more. They'll ship you a tube with this squeegee bulb that goes on the end and also the fluid that goes into the tube. And what you do is, if you look closely, there's a line here on block tester you fill this tube up to the line with that blue fluid and then start the car get it good and warm with the radiator cap off and then once the car is good and warm with the squeegee tube in the block tester stick this in the snout of the radiator and pump it for one minute it actually has a check valve at the base you don't want coolant to get into the block tester just the fumes from the coolant getting into the block tester. You do this for one minute, and if that blue fluid turns yellow, then you know you've got exhaust gases getting into your coolant, and that's what we're gonna do right now. Step one, start it up, get it up to temperature. Okay, all I've done is I popped this rubber cap off, and I'll show you. Just a cap with a hole in it. Poured the blue fluid in up to the line. Okay, and take this cap with the groove and put it back on the tube. And then make sure your squeegee, as I call it, this bulb anyway, the metal part is pointing up. Now you just place that down in there, you can see when you pump it, it's going to suck air up into that fluid. So when we get over to the radiator, we're going to be sucking fumes out of the radiator into this and see if it changes color. game on this is that this tester shows no exhaust gases getting into the coolant. You can see that the fluid is still just as blue as it was when we started the test. And I forgot to mention, when you do this, you're supposed to pump vapor from your coolant into this tube for one minute. Well, I went a little overboard and actually did it about two minutes, but it's still blue. That's a good sign. That means we don't have to replace the head gasket. <laughs> 